good morning and happy Thursday or Friday Eve. So we're off tomorrow for Good Friday. And I also took off Monday, so I'm super excited. I have, I'm not going anywhere, but I just have some personal things I need to take care of. And I'm just going to really devote the weekend, the whole entire weekend to focusing, focusing on the things that I need to take care of. So anyway, here is breakfast. I made um, Jenny O's turkey sausage. I made one piece of the turkey sausage. And I'm using the last slider we have to make me a mini turkey, I mean turkey sausage sandwich with cheese uh, and that's it and I use the medium cheddar medium cheddar deli sliced cheese then so I did a I did a, a hit workout this morning from that in-home challenge that I mentioned so I noticed you know when I have a really good intense workout need some need some extra fuel so I made me a protein yogurt parfait so I put the yogurt in protein yogurt in a bowl and then I've chopped up some fruit from my fruit salad. I just chopped it up so it could be smaller. I added just a sprinkle of granola protein. Protein is really good after workout. And I added, did I add honey? I think I added a drizzle of honey. I think so. Just a little bit. And then I have my tea. So this will be pomegranate raspberry tea. This is a green tea. It's really good. And that will be it. So this is what we have for today. This is breakfast. Hope you guys are having an amazing day and we will touch these. I am headed to my part-time job. So there's an area, it's an area not far from my house. And sometimes when I wanna get out of the house since I work from home and get a change of scenery, I'll go to this location, it's closer than my full-time job, and then work from there. Just bring my laptop and work from there and be around some people. So that's what I'm gonna do. I don't know, I'm feeling a little, like not down, but tired and just like, not all perky and bubbly today. And that's okay. Every day is not going to be a perfect day. Um, I feel a little fluffy too. I don't know, cause I've been having, my appetite has increased lately and I just, honestly, I think I need to be more strategic with my meal planning and protein and stuff. And I've just been kinda, not freestyling all the way, but not being as strategic as I feel like I need to be to be as successful. Um, I don't know, sometimes we're too hard on ourselves. It's like, I wanna lose weight, right? I don't, I don't have a bad body image, so it's not like I feel insecure or anything right now. I feel beautiful. I'm, I am beautiful. I'm amazing. I feel great in terms of that. Like, I've had insecurities in the past about my weight, but I haven't had those in a while since I've been actively doing things about it. Um, I've been okay, but just in the sense of okay, I lost forty. And I'm not weighing I'm not weighing myself, so that might be a part of it, but I hate the scale. So I don't know. I'm just feeling fluffy today. <laughs> um, I think I need to just like I said, I think I just need to be more strategic with how I meal plan and meal prep consistently. I've been working out. I've been actually I've been working out I, I would say more than I was before because I'm just doing it because it makes me feel so good. So that's a huge non-scale victory. We'll go with that. And it's just a day. Like we all have these days where we don't feel our best. We don't feel our most um, positive. Just embrace those and keep, keep it moving. But that's why I'm leaving the house because sitting in the house I know does not help with that for me, with my mental health. So being around people, just being in another environment. And it's a nice office space. It's right across the street from one of our, our really nice malls. So what I might do, I might stay here until the end of my work day and then go to the mall and just walk around for a little bit and get some steps in because it's supposed to rain. So probably won't go to the track later, but I've been really enjoying these evening track walks. They've been really nice. So we'll see how things go. How is your Thursday going? Do you have any plans? Tomorrow's Good Friday. 
so I will be off and I also took off Monday to take care of some some things but um do you have any special plans for this weekend anything you're doing that's fun um I'm not doing anything fun really um just a lot of working but that's okay There's some things I need to catch up on so let me know let's go with today is thankful Thursday what are you thankful for today I am thankful that God woke me up. I am thankful for peace. I am thankful for good friendships and connections. I am grateful for my relationship with my sister. I am grateful that um, I am living in my purpose. I am grateful that both of the positions I currently have are purposeful positions and not just a job so a lot and I could go on and on and on a lot to be thankful for so in these moments I mean we should be reading affirmations every day so we're feeling good but in these moments where I'm just feeling eh, not the best um, mentally it's important to mention the things that you are thankful and grateful for I think that helps a lot with the mental health process so just sharing um i'll touch base with you guys later I'm gonna go i think actually i think maybe i'm tired too i'm gonna go grab me a coffee before i head before i get there and we'll touch base later talk to you later guys a busy day today guys i'm just getting home it's four o'clock four ten actually i'm gonna make me um a lunch wrap I was gonna do a veggie, but I need some a lot of protein. I'm really hungry. I took too long to eat, so I made some steak in the um, in the crock pot last night. So I chopped one up, added a little bit of the gravy to it, added I chopped up some cheddar cheese, sliced up some cheddar cheese. I'm gonna add spinach, mushrooms, and tomatoes to this. Heat it up, um, and I think that's it. I might add some hot sauce to the top, but this is the wrap. Um, this is one guys. So here is the final result. I forgot I got some sweet potato chips, so I'm going to eat some of those. But I'm sorry, I'm eating some nuts. I'm hungry. On my steak wrap, it's melted. It's heated up. I'm not going to move it because it's, it's a little big. So I feel like once I open, once I pick it up, it's going to make a mess. So we're not doing that. This is lunch. Hey, crew. So I got uh, my in-home hit workout in this morning. Um, just got off of work. And I wanted to take a walk. It was nice when I was driving home. But it's not nice right now. It might rain in like the next hour, 45 minutes or so. But I have my umbrella. So if it starts raining, I'm just going to head back home. But I want to get out. I've really been enjoying these after work walks. Even if it's 15, 20 minutes. It just makes me feel so good. And it's kind of separates. It breaks up working right so when i get back home you know it's a shower stretching meditation meditation and um um cooking so it kind of breaks up the day so i've been enjoying these do you guys take walks walks after work what do you do to separate work especially if you work from home what do you do to separate work from being off of work like what do you do i've been finding these walks to be very helpful let me know give me some ideas all right i'll talk to you guys later So I think I need to increase my protein intake because since I've been doing two a day workouts, I've been extremely hungry and eating more than I normally do. So I don't know, just a side note in terms of something I'm thinking about and what I need to do. Anyway, today is, I've been saying happy Friday all day because we're off tomorrow. <laughs> it's been throwing me off anyway. I wanted to treat myself to some pizza, but I didn't want to buy pizza. So I'm going to make some pizza. I'll show you how we're doing that. I got some, this is from Aldi's, uh, two pack of stone oven baked artesian flatbread. So 
I have all of my toppings. I have green, I have red onions, mushrooms, chopped up spinach, some tomatoes, and some green peppers. And here is the flatbread pizza stuff. I put it on the pan, the sheet for us, it's gonna be for me and Josh. I'm gonna pour some olive oil on it um, and then kind of spread that out with my brush and then I'm gonna start topping it, everything on here. I'll show you what it, what it looks like. I also have some turkey pepperoni, so I'll probably add that to some of them as well. I think for me, I'm gonna have a veggie pizza and then I'll just make him a pepperoni pizza with some extra stuff on it. So I'll show you what it looks like once I'm done. Okay, so I added the olive oil and then to season the flatbread, I did add some Italian seasoning, garlic powder, and some onion powder. So that's what's on the base, and I'm gonna start assembling. So this is the finished product. This will be Josh's. This is like, I'm gonna cut that into three slices. And then this is gonna be mine, these little ones on the side. So for his, I think you saw I added red onions, green pepper, spinach, mushrooms, a little bit of tomatoes. I try to camouflage the veggies because he's all about the meat and the cheese, but he'll still eat it. Then for me, just veggies. So I have mushrooms, tomatoes, red onions, spinach, uh, I think that's it. Yeah, I think so. So that's my veggie. My veggie pizza for me for on a Thursday night. That feels like a Friday. And that's Josh's pizza. So here's the compromise, right? Because I wanted pizza. I normally would have ordered Pizza Hut or uh, not Papa John's, Pizza Hut. Uh, Domino's is okay, but I like the, crust, the stuffed crust. We're not doing that. We're going to compromise and make pizza at home. So it's not a salad, but... It's a pizza with uh, lots of veggies on it. I will take it. That's my win. So I'm going to chill tonight. Long week. Even though it's Thursday. I think it's because I had to do so much work in four days. And I'm off Monday too. So I'm just going to enjoy the night. I'm going to actually splurge on a show. Instead of professional development. How about that for a Thursday night? Alright. Check this with you guys later.